Well, he better talk on it. But Jaden Chase, they have met the fans, they know what really I go on. What you talking about? Is Jaden Place. Send us up to the time, you know, a cartel. I represent for Jaden Chase. Blessings Nation, and now welcome to the channel. Your man, Jaden Chase, and another one that we're going to bring on another reasoning on the topic of current affairs. So, if you're new to the channel, well, I'm suggesting that you click the subscribe icon and, of course, let your voice be heard. Like and share the video, and yes, drop a comment in the comment section. Now, let's get right into the reasoning. Now, Nation, Andrew Holness has not confirmed if, if Jamaica's 2022 Independence Day will be the moment Jamaica becomes a republic. He has confirmed, though, his plans to move forward. Now, of course, fans of the dancehall superstar Vibes Cartel is, of course, wondering what this means for Vibes Cartel's UK appeal. Of course, people want to hear from Isaac Buchanan and if there will be any shift in legalities. But first, may I make an hear exactly what was said by Prime Minister Andrew Holness to the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge. And they will discuss what this means for Vibes Cartel's appeal. Look and listen. The people uh, are very expressive. Um, and I'm certain that you would have seen the spectrum of expressions yesterday. Um, there are issues here which are, as you would know, unresolved. Uh, but your presence gives an opportunity for those issues to be placed in context, put front and center, and to be addressed uh, in as best as we can. Uh, but Jamaica is, as you would see, uh, a country that is very proud of our history, very proud of what we have achieved, and uh, we are moving on. And we intend to attain, in short order, our development goals uh, and fulfill our true ambition. Independent, uh, developed, prosperous country. Thank you. Yes, nation, and now let's continue the reasoning. Well, first and foremost, Vibes Cartel's UK appeal is already on the Privy Council books. And attorneys based in the UK have already submitted the necessary documentation. So, Jamaica becoming a republic will have no bearings. And Vibes Cartel's upcoming freedom, along with co accused Sean Stan. But this also brings other questions. Is Jamaica just following the Caribbean's newest republic, which is Barbados, even though the necessary framework has not been put in place? Think about it. Jamaica is still unable to properly manage its affairs think about it in areas like security now we have the jcf working hand in hand with the jdf because they said that the constabulary force cannot manage well ask your friends and family who have joined the jdf or who are still a part of the jdf why this also called the queen's guard and while the idea of jamaica standing up and governing its own affairs is of course how it should be we still have yet to make the necessary changes even within our political landscape we have heard talks from the integrity commission which is the body or the the commission created as oversight for elected officials so as we can check for see who are going to corruption who involved in corruption and things of that nature but we have heard them state that even when recommendations are made elected officials are never prosecuted in the commerce of the same thing about the officers that they have recommended that charges be laid against so as the songwriter say there's a whole heap of work still left to be done before some feel the jamaican island is ready to become a republic now as it pertains to the case itself the defense needs nothing else the defense has everything it needs as a matter of fact if these crucial pieces of evidence were found within the initial trial 
there would be no need for an appeal because Vibes Carter would have been freed. This is how serious the findings are. We have found out from the forensics company, a UK based forensics company. And they have said that yes, tampering did occur. They are saying that yes, evidence was falsified. And they are saying yes, those who submitted the evidence should have known this. You don't need no more than that. The defense has everything it needs. And for the people I wonder if Jamaica becoming a republic is somewhere a form of sabotage of Vibes Cartel's Privy Council appeal. I'm not going to say no. I'm not going to say not necessarily. But I think what takes place with that is just the fact that another country has done so before Jamaica. Keep in mind, even what they when they hear the finance minister said they're going to ease the cost of um, fuel and things of that nature. That was done by the very same country where it is said that Jamaica is following to become a republic. And truth be told, even deeper than that, just like how we have the European Union and a similar construct in Africa, there's a plan to have a similar construct within the Caribbean. That's where you can travel all Caribbean islands and a CARICOM passport. No, they want to put the framework in place where maybe no work permits are needed for individuals. So individuals can just go from, you know what I mean? Island to island, start up business, set up businesses, and we can have, we name them call it the Caribbean Union, but are them going to keep the name CARICOM? Because as it stands, yes, CARICOM has the framework of a union. But where business is concerned, more legislation needs to be either changed or passed to facilitate trade. Similar to our trade agreement, I would say, in Europe. So that might be the reasons why it is being encouraged for Caribbean islands to, you know, become a republic. But those not in the know, most Caribbean islands are owned by the British monarchy. Some are owned by the French. And as you know, Puerto Rico and Bahamas and North America, they are linked with straight. These are territories owned by them. And I think they were also given to them by the British to see me. So you know that. Go. But nation, talk to me. They said that this cannot be reversed. But would you be? As Jamaicans, whether you reside on the island or you reside after the island, you can still put your, your comment in the comment section. Do you think it would be better for the island to form some agreement with, with England to facilitate trade and travel with England and all of its English territories as opposed to breaking off, becoming a republic and trying to figure it out on their own? Keep in mind though, independence happen good while now. We don't make a statement based on that. We get a statement based on the track record of our elected officials on the island and the progress that the country has made since independence till now. Do you think that that progress would have been more if they were a republic? Or do you believe it would have been less? Think about it. Every time something happens, sometimes it's always an international country that steps in and whether them do or say nothing normally just the attention from them gets our government to pivot and change approach and do you think citizens should be given this option to vote on just like how you choose who leads your country should you choose if your country becomes a republic them say out of many one people and they have the actions taken on the island affect all Jamaicans worldwide. Maybe not instantly, but for those who travel back and forth, for those who have family residing there, 
for those who even just have the idea of one day returning as a returning resident. Major decisions like Jamaica becoming a republic. Maybe it shouldn't be just a political decision. Maybe the people should be educated on the pros and the cons. And they should, should have something where people vote upon just like anything else. Talk to me in the comment section. Make me know where you feel. But I said one call. Well, first and foremost, if you're new to the channel, just a pass through. Once you click the subscribe icon, then the bell icon, and of course, put it on all. And this is how you know you'll be notified of all fresh content. As soon as fresh content is uploaded and made available for you, right here upon the platform, the like icon is also in close proximity to the share icon. Drop a like and boost a share. Tell a friend, with, tell a friend, with, tell them sister and them brother them for check out the channel called reasoning. Join the discussion. Remember, the comment section of 24 7 never lucky yet. Just be respectful and mindful of the guidelines. But other than that, you can drop your thoughts and comments and yes, your opinions there. Yeah, man, now move settings, fam. And no, we don't need no ladder. And my sentiments for you and yours is, of course, for to live, love, and prosper. And for to stay tuned until reason again. Jamaica becoming a republic should have no legal bearings and cases already submitted to the Privy Council for ruling. Furthermore, it has not been confirmed if 2022 and Jamaica's Independence Day in that year will be the year the country turns a republic. 